Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It is a wonderful Monday morning, and I am back. And today, I am hunting for a 3D printer. I'm going to take you to your best, and I'm going to show you some of the items I'm interested in. All right, let's start out. Uh, I see an interesting half-price markdown, and there's a 3D printer on the picture. All right, so that half-price lure has some coupons. You can see here the half price items are the smart bracelet, filament. Those prices don't feel half price to me. Do like the price on the U20. That is a large printer like the CR10. Only 259 is a really nice number for that. Um, probably not going to spend that much, and I do want the mixed color, I believe. Do like the idea of the USB 3 adapter. Those are handy dandy. Other than that, I don't see any toys that I'm really hunting for here. Wow, six bucks for a smart tracker. That's interesting as well. I like the Mi Band 3, but 69% uh, off. That's nuts. But let's refocus. We need to get back to finding a 3D printer. So I'm going to go back to 3D printers, and I'm just going to type 3D printer up top. And let's see what kind of options there are. Here is the AlphaWise U20, 29% off. Uh, not really what I'm hunting for, but that is a pretty decent deal. Never seen this HZ324, but that's way outside my price range. I always wanted a CR10, but they're kind of dated now. I don't need that large a build area. Anyhow, I don't believe. Oh, the GE E-Tech A20. Uh, I've actually got a coupon for this for 324, so uh, I will post that. That is one I am thinking about. It is single extrusion. I'm kind of thinking I want a mixed extruder printer. Let's see what happens if we switch to the 1111 deal. Ooh. All right, here's one of my favorites, the uh, Ender 3. Uh, super simple build, 169 probably close to 20 bucks to ship. Here's the A20M mixed color for 349 Here is the A10M mixed color for 229 uh, holy moly that's a lot of five stars i've been on the forums and i've got one a20 and it did build easy mine was not the mixed color uh, i can't give it five stars yet just because there were little things that were glitchy when i was building it uh, in the end it does have cool stuff but i'm not as happy with my a20m as i am with my ender 3 it has been my trusty one that i go to every day Hopefully this one reaches that status, but it's just not there yet. Outside my price range, but interesting, like the big strong base, 45% off is crazy. This little dude is interesting, still way outside my price range. Someday I'd love to do the DLP, uh, but that's still not on my price list. Oh, 500 by 500, that's 50 centimeters, friends. That would be crazy cool to have. Lots of cool options, but I think what I'm going to tell you, friends, is that I'm going to limit it to one of these uh, two printers or perhaps even the cheaper single-color A10M just because uh, that is a nifty printer and I'd have a pair of them. So if something goes wrong, I would have the parts that would help it. This is also a fantastic deal, but I'm not sure I can justify uh, the extra $120. Um, just for really a larger base. I think the build area is identical. I'll actually double check that though. The build area is a little larger on the A20M. The other big thing it has is a really fancy uh, extruder compared to the normal extruder you get on the A10. Uh, these are a little bit higher cost and they're generally considered a upgrade on the other printers like the A10 or even the Ender 3. So, friends, thank you for watching. Uh, I will add links in this video, and I will also add a poll so you can help me pick which one I should buy. Um, actually, I already bought this one before. That's kind of cool to see it up there again. So, friends, if you want to be helpful, please click that 
poll and give me an answer of what you think I should purchase. If you found this video useful, please click that like button. If you haven't subscribed, please hit subscribe. And if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new movie from me, HL Mod Tech, hit that notification bell. Add a comment down below. And friends, once again, thanks for watching.